Today I will be teaching you how to play the saxophone. First, we're going to learn how to put the reed to the mouthpiece. Um, so first, we're going to make sure that the reed is properly soaked. Um, and then we're just going to slide it right between the ligature and the mouthpiece right there. And we're just going to pull that down until we see a very small amount of black from the mouthpiece right above it. About like that. Like that? Yep, looks good. All right, so then we're just going to make sure that we push, pull down the ligature so it's nice and tight on the reed. There you go. Okay. Is that enough black? Yeah, that okay. looks good. And so now we're just going to tighten the screws here just so that they're kind of at least a little tight. You don't want to tighten too much, otherwise it gets a little funky. Like that? Yeah, it looks better. Okay. Okie All right, so now let's talk about the embouchure. So essentially the top teeth are going to be on the top of the mouthpiece here and the bottom teeth are going to be cushioned by your lower lip. Almost just like I said, like a cushion. So let's try just doing that. Uh-huh. And then the rest of your lips are just going to essentially just close around the reed, almost like a drawstring bag. Nice and loose. Very good. And we're going to make sure the corners are a little tight just so that there's not too much movement of the mouth. And so now, just blow into the reed. Very good. Um, so now we're going to start putting the saxophone together now that we've made a sound. So let's put the mouthpiece onto the gooseneck. We're just going to slide it on right there. All right. And so whenever we crow the mouthpiece and the gooseneck, we should hear the note F. I don't have a tuner on me, but we'll just assume that you do have the F. Okay. Sounds good. Um, so now that we have that together, I'm going to teach you how to tongue on the mouthpiece. So essentially, you're just going to touch the, the pad of the tip of the tongue of, the, of your tongue, sorry, onto the tip of the reed right here very lightly and very quickly. So. Very good. All right, so now we're just going to put the saxophone together finally. Um, so let's put the hole here onto the strap right there. Yep. And this is just so that you don't have to hold the full weight of the saxophone and so there's not a lot of movement. And then the gooseneck's just going to go right up there. We loosen the screw so that it goes in a little bit easier and we also tighten it so there's no movement of the gooseneck. Okay, so now the saxophone is just going to rest like very comfortably between the legs. It's okay if it rests on the chair if you're, if you're short enough for that. Um, so if you notice the saxophone mouthpiece is a little lower than it should be, right? We want to have it so it's mouth level. So we're just going to tighten the, the neck strap just a little bit. Okay, let's go up just a little bit more. It didn't move at all. <laughs> is that good? That's, that's fine. <laughs> if that's okay with you, that's all right. Okay. Okay, so now let's just try making a sound on the saxophone. Just blow into it. Okay, good. Um, so that note that you just played is C-sharp, which is just open on the saxophone. So let's go and hear the C-sharp again. Okay. So now we're going to teach you how to hold the saxophone. So we're going to have the left hand on the t upper half of the saxophone and the right hand on the lower half. Perfect. So for the left hand, we're going to only put our fingers on the white pearls that you see here. Um, so for the first finger, we're going to skip the first pearl, go to the second one. Perfect. Second finger, we're going to skip that pearl and go to the next one. And the third finger goes on that. The pinkies are just going to hover over those keys for later. Um, and then on the right hand, just put all your, or each finger on a pearl. That looks good to me. So let's try C sharp again. Perfect. Um, so now let's try B. So for B, we're just going to put down the first finger. Let's go C sharp, B, C sharp, B. Okay. So then now let's go down. So now we're going to learn A. So let's put one and two down. Perfect. Very nice. And now let's try G. Which will be one, two, and three. My bad. 
Very good. So let's try C, C sharp, B, A, and G. Very nice. Thank you for doing this video with me. You're welcome.